Each morning, the 4.30 a.m. alarm clock jolts Nudgy College Swim Club athletes from their slumber to continue their work in pursuit of club and school ambitions. The coaches are committed to providing a daily training environment where success in the pool is inevitable, a tradition that continues under the leadership of swimming director David Proud. Nudgy College Swimming Club is a club that's uh, based in, at Nudgy College and the club is for boys and girls outside the school and obviously school boys. You pay to be a member of the club and you compete at the Swimming Queens and Meets. The school program runs alongside it and we compete at the GPS Championships for Nudgy College. Historically, it's been a very successful program. It's had multiple swimmers who've gone on to represent Australia and other international countries swim here at the college. I've been here since October 2016. The first meet we did was at Queensland State, where the club won zero medals. Fast forward 12 months to 2017, and the club won 36 medals. And the PB percentage was actually 87%, which was a fantastic achievement. A lot of us have been training really hard over the last few weeks. Okay, it'd be great to see a race tonight. There's lots of people here, so really, really good. We're gonna start off with 50 freestyle. For me, um, the biggest message I was getting across to my coaching team was just to try and develop each kid. We try and create an atmosphere and an environment where the kids can get the best out of themselves. Each kid needs to come into the program and develop and learn new skills and improve on them and work really, really hard to try and further their swimming. And I think if we can do that, then the school and the, and the club can develop together. Make every session count. Make sure we're trying to move on the times that we did from last week. I think it can keep going until we are one of the leading programs in the country. Just making sure when you lift your head up to breathe, you've got to keep kicking. Really good job there, boys. Someone who's coming into the swimming program can expect a lot of hard work from the coaches, total 100% commitment and dedication to each individual swimmer. I will be the biggest supporter of each and every swimmer as long as they commit 100% without any compromise. The thing that stands out the most to me is just the friendly environment and, and sense of community. The hundreds of uh, volunteers and people willing to just hook in and get the job done, which is, makes it that friendly environment. You know, my sons have really enjoyed the quality coaching and the programming and um, obviously the access to quality meets and so on for them to achieve their best. So um, yeah, from both of those sides, performance and community um, is, is certainly what I love ab about the Nudgee College Swimming Program. Along with established club pathways and goals, Nudgy boys are given the ultimate opportunity to swim in the 100-year-old GPS competition. Boys, it's down to you to create your own history at the school. To the supporters, you were fantastic in 2017. Let's be even better in 2018. Eddie Brownsey, Angus McDonald, Jackson Cameron, Matt Niebling. GPS is up there with Olympics as the number one for me. I was scared out of my mind. I've seen people do exceptional times at GPS. Boys, uh, we just want to, want to focus this year, just getting around each other. To make every race the, um, a really important part of the night. So thanks boys. The swimmers are alone in the pool, but the team results come first for every nudgy swimmer. The sport can be competitive. Looking for that competition that I like. I like to see that in other people as well. I think the biggest thing is achievement. You see the improvement in the club and that's what swimmers want, I think. They come to a club where there's massive improvement. And improvement is the key driver of results, with Nudgee College working its way from ninth to fifth to third in the last three years of the GPS. 
My plan is to have Australian representatives train at this pool. I think we've got the facilities and, and the coaching staff and the culture within the, the program to do that. I want to see athletes make the Commonwealth Games, make the Olympic Games, so the young kids of Nudgee College have role models to look up to every day in the training program and have that leadership running down the club, and that's really, really important to me. For more information, visit nudgee.com.